Yo, 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 what's good, fans of Fight Fans? This your boy, JB Trap House Boxing, man. I'm back again with another video. Shout out to the LDBC, man. Smash that like button. Smash that subscribe button. Share the video always and leave your thoughts and comments at the end of the video. And if you're looking for that exclusive street news, go subscribe to Urban Media Fix and hit that notification icon bell when no Urban Media Fix drop that heat, man. You know what I mean? And every Wednesday night... The LDBC will be getting together doing our live stream from the Smoke City Mobcast. So every Wednesday night, which is tonight at 9 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time, us, the LDBC, will be getting together doing our live stream from the Smoke City Mobcast. So you make sure you go subscribe to the Smoke City Mobcast and hit that notification icon bell. Make sure you don't miss this heat that we drop. You understand? So... Alright man, so now man, you see it April 7th, we got uh, Julian J. Rock Williams man versus uh, Nathaniel Gallimore. And um, I don't really know, I'm going to be honest with y'all man, uh, I don't really know Gallimore's uh, record. I know, uh, <clears throat> I, I believe, man I ain't going to, I ain't going to, you know, even throw, just throw nothing out there man. I know he got a decent record, you know what I'm saying, so. I know that much. I know he just defeated uh, a man, Justin DeLoach. Knocked him out or stopped him, so to say. And uh, I was really, I was, I was, I was impressed. But at the same time, I was, you know, kind of upset that Justin DeLoach fought that fight the way he fought that fight. You know, he, he kind of played right into uh, my man Nate Gallimore's hands because Nate is a, is a banger, man. He likes to come stalk his guys, seek and destroy, and beat you up and break you down with his uh, body punching and all that. He's a good puncher, you know, pretty decent puncher. He comes and walk you down in the high guard. But this the thing, though, man, uh, you know, J-Rock, you know, he's going to have to try to use his boxing skills as long as he can because then when the boxing skills come out, that's when things going to get rough for J-Rock. And, you know, it's been a proven fact that that J-Rock, you know, will start slowing down around mid-round. You know, he starts fatiguing. P predominantly around about the fourth, fifth round, he start, his technique start getting a little sloppy and go out the window. And he start getting caught more. And, um, you know, J-Rock can get very, very vulnerable. I mean, he can get very, very vulnerable. And this is going to be a good test for J-Rock. It's going to be a good test for, for uh, Gallimore, too, man. You know, Gallimore called J-Rock. He don't call him J-Rock. He said he called him uh, j <laughs> He said he called him J-Pebbles. He said, because, damn, J-Pebbles ain't nothing just an ordinary fight. He said ain't nothing special about him. None of that. He said he going to walk him down. And he asked uh, J-Pebbles where he want to land at. So, you know, when he knock him out, he want to know where he want to hit the canvas at. So man, it's gonna be an interesting fight, man. To be honest with you, um, to me, I think J Rock is a shot fighter, man. I'm gonna be all the way honest with you. I think J Rock is a little, and I had done said this in my last video in the Ishe Smith video, man. I think that that that, that last fight with Ishe Smith, he went to war, got knocked out by Charlo, um, you know. I, I, and, and it's too early in his career, you know, to be going through these type of wars like that. You know what I'm saying? So I, I don't, I don't believe, I don't believe J. Rock can beat Nate Gallimore. Man, I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm, I'm picking. I'm gonna go ahead and pick Nate Gallimore in this, in this, in this bout on April seventh. The, the Laura and and her undercard, and uh, we got James Miguel and Caleb Truex too. So this this is gonna be a deep ass uh card right here, man. This is gonna be the card not to miss. And this is a title eliminator uh, belt, so to say, out here. So uh it's gonna be interesting to see. You know, it'd be sweet to see um Gallimore versus Heard. That'd be nasty. You know. Um somebody ain't somebody gotta go backwards in that fight. But uh, y'all got getting that Gallimore uh, beating J-Rock. I think I'm going to go ahead and pick him by stoppage, probably a uh, knockout. 
pretty much. I think J-Rock is going to, I think that he ain't going to be able to weather the storm too long. It's going to get rough. He's going to have to check out. But it's your boy JB Trap House Boxing. We you waiting on subscribe. I'll holler.